Nuke is a node-based digital compositing application developed by the Foundry, and used for television and film post-production. Nuke is available for Microsoft Windows 7, OS X 10.9, Red Hat Enterprise Linux 5, and newer versions of these operating systems. NUKE's users include Digital Domain, Walt Disney Animation Studios, Blizzard Entertainment, DreamWorks Animation, Sony Pictures Imageworks, Sony Pictures Animation, Framestore, Weta Digital, Double Negative, and Industrial Light and Magic. History Nuke the name deriving from New Compositor was originally developed by software engineer Phil Beffrey and later Bill Spitak for in-house use at Digital Domain beginning in 1993. In addition to standard compositing, Nuke was used to render higher resolution versions of composites from Autodesk Flame. Nuke version 2 introduced a GUI in 1994, built with FLTK, an in house GUI toolkit developed at Digital Domain. FLTK was subsequently released under the new LGPL in 1998. Nuke won an Academy Award for Technical Achievement in 2001. In 2002, Nuke was made available to the public for the first time under the banner of D2 Software. In December 2005, D2 Software released Nuke 4.5, which introduced a new 3D subsystem developed by Jonathan Eggstad. In 2007, The Foundry, a London based plug in development house, took over development and marketing of Nuke from D2. The Foundry released Nuke 4.7 in June 2007, and Nuke 5 was released in early 2008, which replaced the interface with Quart and added Python scripting, and support for a stereoscopic workflow. In 2015, the Foundry released Nuke non-commercial with some basic limitations. Nuke supports use of the Foundry plugins via its support for the OpenFX standard several built-in nodes such as Keylight or OpenFX plugins. Topic. Similar products VSDC Free Video Editor Fusion – Blackmagic Design Boris Red – Boris FX Natron While not dedicated to compositing, the open-source software Blender contains a limited node-based compositing feature which, among other things is capable of basic keying and blurring effects. <laughs>